Hi, welcome back. This is Excel Video 82. Today we're gonna we're we're gonna do something a little more fun. We've kind of been through a lot of you know all these different things that a lot of basics, a lot of fundamentals. It's time to start uh, bringing out a little bit of the bag of tricks, and and then we'll we'll take it big time from there once uh, once we get past a couple of these videos. But this is the plot area of a chart, and what you can do in a plot area is you can turn it off or you can show it, but right now the default color is the same color as the chart. So that doesn't show you much. Let's put plot, plot area options. We can put no fill or a solid fill in any color you want. Something like that there. You can do a gradient fill. Remember gradient, you can start with one color and blend into another. Watch the, see this line here as, it, as the gradient moves from one end to the other. And you can make those, you know, whatever types of directions, um, radial and um, whatever kind of color you want. And you can do all kinds of things with fill. Make it look like the sun setting or whatever. Uh, you can do automatic, or this is picture and texture fill. I have a texture here. You can do this texture in the back there. And again, you can make it more or less transparent so it doesn't have to be all the way dark if it kind of competes with your data you can just make it a little more transparent there's a bunch of textures in here that you can choose from something like that and again you can make the transparency something like that that's easy the last thing I want to show you is you can insert things too from the from a file from a clipboard from clipart you can put all kinds of things back here. So I'm going to go, I don't need that right now. Oh, I guess I do need it for this. Let's go to File. You'll recognize this picture. And I can put my ocean thing. Let's just close it for a second. In the background, you can do whatever kind of picture you want. You can do a company logo back there. I mean, if this is, okay, you know, if um, collections meet this amount or the doctor meets this uh RVU gold or whatever it is, you can put a picture of the you know the beach, the sunset, whatever you want behind that, and it's really easy to do. You can move the picture around. There is a bunch of things you can do with um, the offsets, right bottom. You can move it around. You can stretch it, um, and again, you can make it a little bit lighter. Or you may say, no, 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 I want this front and center. I want you to remember this. All easy things to do, and it re now we're really starting to make the the graph look pretty cool to have that you know that kind of thing in the background um, now we've got now we're starting um, that's what I wanted to go through today from the plot area uh, the format tab has a whole bunch of things that can just format I mean if you click on collections there are things you can do for each part of the chart that we've been through a legend or the axes or the title or whatever you can format those in a variety of different things you can go through this analysis area but that's a little more complicated we're gonna spend several videos on that what I want to do next is really start taking off. We've gone through the fundamentals. We can do some pretty things. Now let's really start making uh, powerful charts in Excel 2007. Stay tuned.